All right. Sujin is back with a brand new solo music video. Mona Lisa. So I've been waiting for this for a while now. Um, please go ahead and hit the thumbs up and subscribe to my video if you guys are fans of G-Idol or if you guys are fans of Sujin herself. Uh, please go ahead and give me a follow. Um, so, okay. Um, I've been dealing with some copyright stuff. Um, no strike, but a lot of my uh, Filipino pop music and some of the J-pop music videos, like the like official music videos, um, are getting I don't know the uh, the Google content ID detection bot that's ran by artificial intelligence is being a little bit strict so um not only are they flagging my my uh most recent filipino pop music video reactions but they're flagging the older ones too so um i don't know what to say to that other than um i've listened to the community it seems like you guys are telling me um to react to like dance practice videos or performance dance performance videos or even like a, like a mic'd up video you know where they where the group just sits down and then sings on the microphone whether it's a live vocal with a live band or they're singing a cappella to one of their hit songs so i'm gonna try and do that from now on especially um for filipino pop um but we get that out of the way um because that issue it, it just messed up the last two weeks have really messed up my channel big time um i had like a total of 13 videos be wiped off my channel that totaled over twenty thousand views and it, it's very disheartening very disheartening and it, and it hurts a little bit too you know because i am i am half filipino and i really want to you know listen to music from the motherland but man it's it's rough it's rough so uh we're gonna take it easy this next week uh we're just gonna stick to uh k-pop and uh, japanese metal if there's any coming out within the next couple of days so sujin formerly of g idol arguably my favorite member of that group but i still like them there's you know idol is still one of my top five girl groups today but um you know sujin's situation it sucks um I, I i think i've said this before on many of my other videos that i think cube is trash <laughs> but um i digress let's go ahead and watch this mv let's go My goodness, look at that. Oh! Oh my gosh. The fairy prince has come to life. This girl needs to she she needs to come stateside. She needs to tour stateside. Seriously. Hold on. Did they really blur her feet? I know some of y'all be kink shaming out there. I see you all on social media. Okay, chill. Whoa. Got that little bit of a South American beat. Boom, 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 boom. Oh. 
You know, you know what I don't understand. Okay, let me let me switch back to the full screen real quick. I I, I gotta say something. Um, so I understand that the pandemic era of music videos it really warranted a lot of official music videos to have people wearing masks. This, the backup dancers wearing masks, right? I noticed that almost every single K-pop company and agency especially the smaller ones, they're keeping this tradition of having the backup dancers wear face masks a lot more. I mean, they, there, there, there were, there were um, music videos that the backup dancers had to cover their faces before the pandemic era, right? But it was standardized. Um, and then even when the lockdown period ended and then everybody started doing concerts live the backup dancers and everything you know they still had wore masks i don't know man like i just find it i i i, I don't know if it's just the concept how it is maybe they want all the attention her face to be shown but me i am somebody who appreciates backup dancers Okay. Um, and I would love to see the faces of the backup dancers. So, you know, but at least, at least, um, I, I can understand why they did it. All right, let's go. You know, let me go back here. Let me go back here. If she had another mole on this eye here, I would have thought that she's BB's sister. <laughs> yeah. This song makes me want to... <laughs> I'm going to put this, I can tell you right now, the first time I heard her first single, what was it, Agashi? I'm going to put this one right up there. I, I can't like Mona Lisa more than that. I, I, I seen Agashi like maybe like 20 times, but this is so good that I'm even starting to wonder if I like this one more. So for now, I'm going to say I like this track the same as Agash. Oh yeah, look at that. See, this definitely works. That sh all of her backup dancers have mask on. Especially with the uh, the two tone coloring with brown and black, um, it really made her stand out even more. So again, like I said, I understand conceptually, concept wise, I get it, but I don't like that. <laughs> That's just me because I really appreciate backup dancers. Um, so I really enjoyed it. I think it's a ten out of ten. Um, I'm hyped. I I feel so much better i feel like the stress just melting away just melting away and, I'm, and a lot of uh a lot of you guys from the philippines who can speak english and who've joined my discord or who have messaged me here 
or on even on my Twitter, you guys, some of you guys have um, Twitter X, whatever you guys want to call it. You guys followed me on there, and um, I really appreciate it. You know, um, all all of the amazing, um, should I say? I wouldn't say advice. <laughs> it's more like you need you need to do this. You need to do this. And they, I I get it. It's like um. It's, it's, it's exciting when you find somebody all the way across the world that has the same interest or is starting to get into something that you are very passionate about. Um, I think out of all of the regions that I have subscribers from, I think the Philippines is like the most passionate. It's like, oh, Ben, you gotta, you gotta check this out. Like, um yeah it's it's like i'm never gonna be <laughs> you guys are giving me like way too much stuff to do um but i i kind of have to lay off so so if you're from the philippines and you're a subscriber to me i have to slow down on the p-pop stuff be uh, because you know uh 10 days later i'm still getting my older p-pop videos being blocked globally even the ones that have been on my channel for almost two years so um it hurts but yeah um anyway um i am going to be begin doing content on my second channel i'm going to be reacting i'm not reacting i'm going to be reviewing uh television shows movies um i'm also going to be uh, doing uh, product unboxes and product reviews. Um, the first, I think I'm going to be, uh, the first content I'm working on is a doozy. It's it's going to be a Korean drama reaction. Uh, I keep saying reaction, a Korean drama review. Uh, so if you guys want to, you know, subscribe to my review channel, there will be a link in the description and it's called Spicy Ben TV. Just Spicy Ben TV um yeah so i'm already writing the script for it i kind of want it to be structured uh, so i can like kind of like read off a bullet point and then edit and make it more concise where i'm you know i'm not going to be going um uh, uh uh all the time like on my reaction videos you know so you guys don't have to see me trying to think of what to say i already have everything written down so if you guys want to check that out, I'll leave the link down below to that video, uh, to that channel. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. I'm going to listen to this song on Spotify over and over and over and over and over again. Peace.